Hey guys, and welcome to Strictly Diaries. I am here with Gleb. Oh my god, babe, it's so good to see you. You too, too. Thank the you. last time Gleb and I saw each other, you were quietly confident about this series, and I can understand why. I kind of feel really good confident right now because I, um, I did, now I did already, this is my fourth Strictly uh, Condensed or whatever you want to call it, that's what started all different things. You are now in the semi-finals with semi Anita. Semi-finals, it's, semi it's absolutely crazy. amazing. You're doing such a great job. What do you think is the reason why your partnership is so successful? I mean, we put so much hard work in and a lot of hours of training. Um, I'm trying to push myself too, you know, working mental hours even off uh, our hours of training. Just doing a lot of at home, and uh, um, well, I don't know. I just love dancing, you know. Yeah, I mean it shows, and obviously Anita's got the bug off of you because it seems that she's just really dedicated to the process. Yeah, she's killing. The most important thing that she wants to learn how to dance, and that's that's important for you know for us professional dancers that you have someone who willing to learn, and you just. Try, try. I'm so excited to be here. I have, I feel like I've been waiting for this day my entire life. And what would you say has been your favorite routine out of all of the ones you've done? I would since? say the favorite routine was the Paso, mm -hmm. where we were in Blackpool. In Blackpool. Um, Amazing. Yeah. Everything from the concepts, and she was so in it on her own, standing yeah. there. Yeah. You know, a lot of the other dancers have some kind of dance training. Um, were you a bit worried about that? Thinking, oh my God, how am I going to get her up to, you know, that standard? I wasn't thinking about it. I was thinking week by week, you know, like just do my best, teach her whatever I can. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, it's been great so far. And there is a lot of uh, trained dancers, I mean, trained celebrities. Yeah. And she has zero dance experience, zero dance experience, never danced before. Um, and you, I mean, you can see it in some of the dances that you know there could be better, there could be better feet point and stuff. Mm -hmm. But that's what public loves, and they've been voting for us, and it's been great. The judges are very up and down. I would say, of all the couples that are left, you guys have the most controversial marks. You know, yeah. it's like up here and then down here. Yeah. Does that affect you guys? Like, how do you come back after? Like, we we listen to the judges' comments, mm -hmm. but we don't take it like to heart. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I mean, Mars has been up and down, you know, and mm -hmm. uh, some of the dancers think, oh my god, we, we did a great job. It could have been a nine or, a, you know, an eight and it's six. Yeah. Uh, but it doesn't matter, you know, judges are great. Yeah, well, that's good. I mean, it's good to have a positive attitude about it. If you make it to the finals, yeah. what are you going to do? Um, yeah, we're going to do a contemporary freestyle. Ooh, yeah. I'm sure Len will love that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he just loves it. Tea <laughs> in, uh, in the world of skinny lattes, he called himself. He called himself a what? A cup of tea in the world of skinny lattes. He's hilarious. Yeah. I do yeah. love it. Okay, so the question was from Karen Gross, and she said, What is the process of teaching a non dancer? Well, there's different process, you know, for the for the TV show, like strictly. Mm -hmm. And if you just go to the studio and learn how to dance, I come up with uh, with a routine, mm -hmm. and it's finished on Monday. And I teach her the steps, and we at the same time we just work on the technique. How was it though when you first walked into the studio? And you were like, okay, so let's do a basic, and she's like, what? <laughs> like, yeah. how is well, that? I was, how no, I always just go that? step to the right, step to the left, turn. Keep your knees straight, you know, point your foot, let's do it again, let's do it again, let's do it again. Consistency, God, let's, keep going, yeah, yeah. keep going. And let's move on, let's do the, the next step. And then piece by piece we built up the routine and that's... And that's how you get yeah. there. Wow, amazing. What do you think is most important? Musicality, technique or character and expression? I think it's all the things come together. Mm. You know, you have to be... Uh, musical you have to have a great technique and you got to have a good concept you yeah. know great costumes you know great makeup 
great pops and set and it, it comes you know together and you do a great job of that do you do you come up with all the ideas and then just tell everybody you know i want anita to wear this yeah. i want her makeup to be like this you yeah. kind of do yeah. all of that yeah yeah i do oh. everything yeah just like this is what i have in mind and you know this is what i want mm -hmm. and then send them the pictures and they're like okay we'll, we'll do that that's awesome yeah that's so cool. I've loved the journey and all your choreography. It's just been great in terms of songs as well. Do you get to pick your own songs? Well, sometimes they uh, they suggest something and mm -hmm. I suggest something and they'll kind, kind of, of go back yeah, and forth yeah. until everyone's yeah. happy. Yeah. Cool. Thank you so much for taking the time. Thank They're you. so busy. They've just finished rehearsing. They're trying to close the studio. We're just standing out here trying to get a few bits in before you go home, hopefully, and grab some sleep before yeah. you Come start on, rehearsing again. Nine, nine o'clock. What about Christmas, though? When you finish and everything, you're going to be able to have some time with family. You're going to stay in, a, in uh, London. Born with a twist in Florida, in Miami. Oh, wow, no with rest. Tristan. Yeah, no rest. Oh, so wow. So the next day, on the 20th, I fly to Miami. <laughs> and then throughout the whole Christmas, New Year's, you'll be doing like eight shows. Wow, and no then, rest for the wicked. No. Wow. And then coming back here for a tour. I'm doing a tour, a Strictly tour. Awesome. So yeah. we're able to catch Gleb on the Strictly tour. Yep. And I saw that calendar. I want one. Can I get one? Yeah, sure. I need one of those calendars. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. It's Calendar. pretty awesome. Exactly. Well, thank you so much, my thank darling. You. And thank, thank you. you so much, guys, for watching. Take care. Bye. Bye.